Stop! What did she throw? Yuki? Oh, come on! Oh, got a plastic of carrots. And that is why we should put all our efforts chasing after this story. Thank you. Is the cold bird oh, video sorry. done? I... Is the no, cold... I, I was... cold bird video done? No, but then day. Every day you judge what? Every video I ask you to do is delayed or green screen. And your viewership numbers barely hit the hundreds. It's true. The last video we did has 92 views. No likes, one dislikes. Two dislikes! Dave, we are a small operation. We cannot be chasing baseless stories. Why can't you be like that and follow stories I assign. No one buys groceries and goes walking down the drain. So I believe there's a story here and that will probably bring our digital... And what if it doesn't? Real quick! On! Whoa! There! First time seeing you OT! What you working on? Bye. Bye. Found a mama shop near the drain. Uh, seems like a good place to start. Hmm. Let me just go and pack my stuff. No, 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 no. You know what? I had enough of a big mouth today. So why don't you go and get that? The, what's that bird? Cool. Ah, why don't you go and get that video? Uh, but I, I, no I, but. If you, no ifs. Just go. G O Go. Oh, hi, Ted. Shh. Hey, were you listening on us? One day I'm gonna slap the fellow to you. Okay, so. Uh... Excuse me. Um. Seriously? That's what. How much? Eighteen dollar ten cent. Eighteen dollars for a packet of cigarette. Rainwalkers tax. Ever since they come and sell their contraband, my business failed. <laughs> These people are like cockroaches, huh? Ah, yeah, okay. Have you seen this woman? Ah, every week they come and uh, buy their groceries here. Why, huh? I believe she's one of these uh, drain walkers. Oh, yeah. Hey! Hey! Hey, wait! Stop!
Wow, looks like these people really care about Mother Nature. Choice of color, black, okay. Uh, where do they wash their clothes? Oh, okay. Wow, they can afford a feast. <laughs> Even I don't eat that much. Ah, so she is one of them. Police, look, look. My name is Dave Anand, reporter, reporter. Okay, I, I, I want to tell your story. Mana kau so, aku? Um, are you a smuggler? Smuggler? Bukan aku, cleaner, kopi tiap. Show me a work permit. Huh? Work permit. Show me a work permit. Amara. 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 Durang dah kena tangkap. Times exclusive, brought to you by Ted Lim. Me. Three foreign contraband smugglers were arrested this morning in a crackdown operation by the brave policemen. Two more of these foreigners are still at large, somewhere in this forest. What if they attack these innocent Singaporeans? Residents and shop owners of Bukit Panjang have long been terrorized by these shady foreigners. First, they bring their problems, drugs, crime. What is next? A tip-off from a concerned shop owner, Mr. Jagadish Shah, gave them the breakthrough. Do you believe these people are terrorists? Yes, of course. They're terrorists. And many women jog here at night, you know. What if they put their hands on them? This report has surpassed all of your views in less than three hours. <laughs> 
And that's because he stole our story and he sensationalized Enough. it. Enough! That has an initiative and drive to dig out new stories while you are just a mediocre journalist. Get out of my sight. This is really... Let's celebrate. Happy hours! Yes, boss! Uh, Dave? Dave? Ted beat you to it. Should we give this up? He stole our story. Well... What do you want from the story? Fame? Hey, hey, listen. I am not a mediocre journalist. I know what we have and it can go viral. All we have to do is just edit it and just present it in such a way... Is views all you care about? Sensationalizing the story like Ted? We should be presenting the truth and not distorting it. Wow. That was... Um... That was uh, really smart coming from uh, you. Okay. Um, yeah, you know what? You are right. I should let it go. What's that? Um, the the name of that stupid bird? Call. Yeah. Mm. Why don't you give me that and I'll look into it. Mm. Yeah. Truth. Someone's here to see you. <coughs> what are you doing here? Tolong. Mereka je lah yang saya ada. They're the only ones you have. Aku akan bagi apa yang kau nak. Cerita kau. She'll give you a story. Dave, please. Hey, you just said give it up. Dave, this is an opportunity. Opportunity for truth. Ini Asri. Dia terpaksa tinggalkan keluarga dia kat kampung sebab dia perlukan duit untuk pembedahan anak dia. Tapi syarikat dia tutup tanpa sebarang notis. Dia Samir. Dia datang kerja sebagai cleaner. Tapi work permit dia dibatalkan macam tu je. Sebab majikan dia tuduh dia mencuri. Dia ada dua orang tua untuk dijaga. Faris. Atau kami panggil dia abang. Sebab dia lah yang beri kami perlindungan di saat yang paling rendah. Kita ikut dia ke Causeway untuk collect treatment. Dia janji yang dia akan lepaskan kami apabila dah cukup duit untuk pulang. Ishan. Macam adik. Ejen kat kampung 
janji yang dah dapatkan dia kerja. Tapi bila dia sampai sini, rupanya permit kerja dia palsu dengan hutang yang menimbun kat kampung. Dia terpaksa jual barang seduk. Saya, saya terpaksa jual rokok ni sebab saya ada dua orang anak untuk beli makan. Permit kerja saya dah tamat. Tapi saya tak boleh pulang sebab saya belum cukup duit lagi. Kan orang jahat. Cuma keadaan yang memaksa kami buat begini. Tolong menilai kami setelah mengetahui kisah kami. Oh, Melayu. How to understand? I can subtitle it. No problem. But this very drama I like. Ah, uh, boss, we have the power to tell two sides of the story, and I. Dave, you can leave now. Boss, but I. Congratulations, 40,000 views in just six hours. More than that's total view. You have elevated the company. Let's drink. How dare you? You manipulated the video for clicks? We can't just drop the lines like that. Dave! You set out what you promised me, and you did it. You are not a mediocre journalist after all. In fact, I think you are better than that. That's not the point. We are supposed to stand for and publish the truth. Dave, Dave. You let a criminal go right under my nose. You are a lucky boy. I did not have you arrested. Gee. We are not the police. We can write and present the That's facts. That's point is. Facts don't sell. A story of heroes and villains do. People wants to feel, not to think. And nobody wants to read in between the lines. They want the lines clearly defined for them. <laughs> Where's your journalist integrity? Huh? Look at it this way. With your video, the police finally located where she was. And we, we finally stamp up all the cockroaches. <laughs>